Uh, but he decided to, you know, he's like, I don't want to go out like this. And he turned it on and he made it all the way to give me an MK Leo run for money. Yeah, he beat so <laughs> many people, too, to get there. I forget exactly who it was, but he ran through the gauntlet, man. Yeah, he wanted to put a, an exclamation point on his campaign for the uh, for summit voting. Absolutely, and definitely showing why he deserves it. But right now, trying to do the same thing once again to Wadi. It'll be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Um, you know, Rob had always been, I guess, historically. Um, Zero suit, <laughs> Zero suit has always been historically difficult for Rob to oh, deal yes, with. Oh, yes, and she still is. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> she can just combo this character for free, as she always has. But, uh, you know, Rob with more tools this time around, mm -hmm. so he's able to actually make this matchup look a little bit better. Yeah. But, oh, oh my, my God, God. he edgeguard him for the entire, like, how long is this match been going? Like, 40, 40 seconds? seconds? 45 he seconds. was off stage for the whole 40 seconds. We're going to need Wadi to uh, pause the game after the results screen and just look at the air time on the character. Seriously. All right, but right now, Wadi trying to bring it back, see what he can do. Get this edge guard situation up. Nice up air right there. Ooh, and he's picking up a lot of momentum. That's so much damage unanswered. Oh, man. Mars so fortunate that that air dodge wasn't clipped. Yeah, Mars plays it real safe getting back to the stage. I mean, he can mix it up in so many different ways. We have flip kick. We have side B. We can jump super high. And then boost kick, of course, comes out of the blast zone. Oh, wow. I like the spacing from Wadi right there. That Make sure you be safe. And, of course, down throw to up smash. Going to take it. Yeah, the tried and true, uh, the, the tried and true throw combo. Yeah, it's almost beat poop, <laughs> but not quite. So you can actually mash out of that situation now. But when you're at higher percent, it's way harder to mash out. Yeah, obviously. The, the mash of the god. It's like right. ask Mars, like, have you been working out your thumbs? I hope so, <laughs> or you're not getting out of this. Yeah, if you're at 150 plus, just let it go. Yeah. <laughs> All right, yeah. we got the down tilts right here. Side note, don't actually let it go. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, how can he get back on the stage, man? Mars is not allowing this boy to land or to get to that ledge. Oh my goodness. Wow, crafty focus. recovery from Wadi though. Just right. battling his way back. It looked like Mars was fiending for him, but... And he's still able to survive a boost kick. Wow. Yeah, good DI, man. Everything in this game seems like you're going to die and suddenly you just make it back. Oh, uh, <laughs> I don't know if he ran out of gas or if he air dodged. I think he air dodged. Yeah. But yeah, it's kind of a scary spot when you have Zero Suit flip kicking over top of you. It's like, what option do you take? I don't know. That wasn't it, though. And Mars just doing such a good job being so aggressive in Wadi's face, not really letting him set up too much. And going to whiff a grab, but up smash again. Not going to kill in a game like this. Definitely would have taken it in Smash 4, though. That's why he obviously went for it. And either way, going to rack up some damage and put Mars in a bad spot. But now, man, Mars having control of that gyro, and he's going to get these up airs. And Mars able to get the wheel turning just a little bit. It's been Wadi's show for just a few seconds. And Wadi finally <laughs> able to hit the main stage. You see him uh, catching the gyro so much. That's like, incredibly good. I feel like characters that have projectiles, people are often scared to use those projectiles against the main character and immediately just throw it away. But I don't know. I think if you can use those projectiles yourself, it can be quite beneficial. Oh, that was a really early mash out. He picks up the upper there. Yeah, that time he was able to get it. It's, it's such a weird grounding. Yeah, he mashed out at like 130 or something. Right. Like that. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> All right, the Zare right into a forward air. Oh, it wanted to follow with a boost kick. Would have been super clean. Good back air, though. Yeah, nice Wadi drop zone. And Wadi's in all kinds of trouble. I like it, I guess. Oh, but he's going to roll after all that work. Maybe buffered it from the, uh, the oh, air yeah, dodge yeah. on might accident. Have definitely might have done that. Mars, the aggression, it can't be stopped. <laughs> oh, yeah. Takes game one. That's exactly what you have to do. Sometimes uh, myself as a ZSS, I like to fade back and try to like zone somebody yeah. out. But you never see Mars zoning anybody. Right. He's just completely in your face and never allowing you any room to breathe. Just like this cold is doing for <laughs> me right now, man. Oh, you're doing great. Just hang me. in there. <laughs> Gone bate, my yeah, friend. I'm Hold on. Rob, just trying to, I'm trying to live. Get out of my face. But here we go. Game two. Let's see how Wadi can adapt. And let's see if there's been any changes to the stages. I got Smashville now. Opening it up, so a little bit of a smaller stage. That kind of seems to be the thing now that we've seen. Uh, Wadi maybe has a preference for some of the, the smaller stages. Man. Maybe just trying to corral, corral Mars just a little bit. <laughs> this was his favorite stage in Smash 4 uh -huh. is Mewtwo, but I don't know. Ro Ro his Rob would usually go over to Battlefield, but uh -huh. if you're taking ZSS to Battlefield, you must want to lose. Right. That's, that's got to be difficult sometimes, you know, when certain character arch archetypes like the same stages that you like as a player right. and you can't pick it and you're just not really sure. Exactly. And man, it's just so much aggression that comes from Zero Suit that, oh, the tech? Wadi must want to win. Like, yeah. he's really playing right now if he's teching. And has a multi hit tech, too, because there's a forward air, not like a back air or right. an up air. So <laughs> you excellent. had to read that out. Very good by him. 
All right, but again, you see Mars catching that gyro, trying to use it against him, covering the high recovery that he knew Wadi would go for. And yeah, yeah he's, he's queued on. Roddy's just trying to roll out of it and get back to center stage, and that's the second boost kick we've seen in that situation. Oh, there? To back air? That actually connected, and I like it a lot, too, because he saw Mars coming at him aggressively, but he was able to snuff out her forward air with that. So, uh, very smart. Yeah. <laughs> Seeing, uh, get, taking a little inspiration from some of the Mars Zero Suit options. You have right. a neutral air to back air? Let me, let me show you mine real <laughs> yeah, quick. Yeah, <laughs> he's like, hold on, let me try that. Good idea. I like it. Oh, Mars is going to fade real low to get that. That was a precarious situation. I thought if uh, Wadi might have thrown out a forward air just to throw out a hitbox, a weak one, it might have done a lot of... Uh, damage on that recovery but plasma yeah. web comes for him and we're even yeah rest in peace on that usually you don't see wadi getting hit by that move but uh and mars uh, rarely throwing it out himself so good on him to get the stock there yeah it definitely looks like he's holding on to it as it's kind of uh his emergency you know read kill option surprise because he doesn't ever really use it the little percentages yeah i do i definitely like that a lot uh coming from mars and now all this aggression again keeping wadi trapped on the left side what can Wadi do, man? He doesn't get any space to set up his uh, projectile game. And you know that's something Wadi loves. And in the meanwhile, like all the combos that, that Mars is doing. Oh, that's a big play. That's is take he it. dead? Yep. Oh, he had already jumped. Yeah. Big flip kick. He did the, uh, the the wrong flip kick where he doesn't kill his momentum. Right. Well, unfortunate spot for him. And smart on Wadi to pick up such an early kill. But can he get back on the stage? That is the real question. No, he cannot. And there's the, the Mars special, the flip jump on the ledge recovery situation, able to kill it with that flow jump kick. Just very classic Mars play. Right. And I think that's one of the first lasers we've seen in the entire set. <laughs> Finally able to get a projectile out. Right. The two stats we need to look at the airtime and his projectile count. Yeah, how many match. did he get? Oh, he meant to gyro and you know it. Yeah. The side B accidentally. Only got to take a small punish for it though. Fortunate to get away with just that. Right. Now Mars setting up his projectiles into a, a okay, the jab going to get snuffed out by a gyro. Now he's covering this ledge once again. So Mars much going back to the him. going back to the aggression. Yeah, definitely what he wants to do here. Don't let Wadi oh, set up. Oh no! Him. Here we go. Ooh, this the platform. Ooh. That could have been so disgusting. If only this was Smash Four, man. That was a game of frames. That was just barely. That last up air, if it connected, it was over. But right. Wadi fortunate to get out. And did you see Mars angling his shield downward? <laughs> you gotta love that. He saw Wadi charging up that up smash forever. He's like, let me put this downward before his shield pokes me. So smart by Mars. Ooh, and a scary trade for Wadi. Oh, uh, if he's able to get back, he's in business, but he's got to get back. That's tough. Ooh, he rolls every time. He's got to be careful with that. After escaping everything that Mars puts out, he does do those rolls. Very risky. I think it's because he's he wants to respect the uh, the flip jump option, so. Right, very true. He's uh, just kind of not sure exactly how to navigate that situation. It's tough. And can Wadi edge guard Mars this Oh, time? he rolled back in. That's unfortunate. Yikes. And then, yeah, Mars going up 2-0. Oh, but oh, we're in so the semi, so we could be three okay. out of five. It's three strikes you're out at this point, or three strikes to the loser's bracket. And Wadi in red alert now as far <laughs> as uh, danger to being knocked down into losers. Right. <clears throat> yeah, and, you know, if you're if you're Wadi, you kind of got to be kicking yourself a little bit because you opened up such a huge lead with that really brilliant yeah. Uh, play on uh, you know, Mars coming in from the advantage and misses a flip jump kick. And, you know, Wadi capitalized as best he could, but he was still not able to hold that lead to, to the finish. Let's see if he's able to turn it around and flip the script and maybe steal a game. And, you know, that's the start of a comeback, right? The first game. Got to yeah, win the first one. And another one of those misinputted side beats is going to cause him to get a little bit punished there. And it, you just don't see him able to set up anything. And playing with a little bit of fear, letting Zero Suit go through the full cycle of the short hop. Land and then grab. That's like a three-quarters of a second wait right, time. Right, it's so long. <laughs> but yeah, Wadi, man, not sure what he can do in this situation. Mars all over him. And yeah, Mars is kind of landing anything that he wants. Oh, almost got a back here right there, too. Ooh, good tech again from Mars this time. Ooh, get a spot dodge and up B. Wow. So clean and taking the stock right there, too. That was a good read. You know, he's putting pressure on that shield of jab. And, of course... The Wadi's natural inclination is just to try to grab it, spot dodge, the boost kick, and we're, here we are. But wow. a good back air yeah, by Wadi, big plays. That spinning arm setup, and then Mars having a little bit of trouble getting back to the stage. Tries to immediately stand, and Wadi going to back air for it. But yeah. Mars right back in this, man, getting 43, 54 already on the board. Yeah, well, uh, Mars just kind of emptying out everything that he's got as far as reads and just throwing everything that he has at Wadi. And it's working. <laughs> yeah, and I love that mix-up he did right there. Like you said earlier, he did that full hop and then land grab. This time he did full hop, land, and then uh, jabbed yeah. him. So he actually caught him dropping that shield. 
He almost got the smash for uh, Mar, especially with the up air, up air flip jump kick. Right. <laughs> Wow, just Wadi just nowhere to go, tried to air dodge through. He actually had time to do two back airs. That's insane. Mars so smart to keep swinging that aggression, too. Sorry, good forward air. Wadi trying to start something up. He put his gyro out there for once, but it immediately got snuffed out by the shield. All right, All right a little there bit it of is. Action. Here we go for Wadi. He just need a couple big plays, and he's right back in it. Uh, and you know he wanted to get a grab or something like that, yeah. but Zero Suit's frame one jab going to be so scary to deal with. But held control of this stock for a little bit of time. Let's see. <laughs> He's got a little time to set up a gyro. Oh, man. Just yeah. kind of got caught sleeping, and Mars is back to work. All right. She's got this ledge trap situation once again. Oh, I thought a dare was coming out. Yeah. <laughs> I, got, <laughs> I, I felt it. We've seen him do it so many times, and it works out great. Oh, no punish on that landing of the air dodge. Unfortunate for Wadi. Yeah, it's a little tentative. You know, if you get hit enough times by a p player of Mars' caliber, you start second guessing some of your neutral yeah, it's options. Yeah, like, can I do something here? I really don't know. Wadi's going to have to end this right now if he wants any chance of uh, winning this game three. The Mars is throwing out everything. And, uh, Wadi doesn't really seem to have a clear-cut answer. This might be something big that he okay, needs. Yeah. Here we go. Lucky right there to be able to get the down smash situation. Mars trying to go for that up be real risky. But he actually was invulnerable, so yeah, no risk. Yeah, <laughs> he had some of the invulnerability. He probably could have been clipped by a, by a quick aerial or something like that, but nothing too big from Wadi. Ooh, and Wadi trying to, oh, oh my goodness, my the boost kick coming in. But it, yeah, he should be able to live right there, and he does. Throwing all of his projectiles at Mars, like, please, just let me get back to the stage. And the desperation recovery, he's able to get back. And got the weak hit of the uh, the flip jump. Right. And... Uh-oh, Nair coming through. Oh, the side <laughs> B almost catching him off guard off the stage there. Smart angle from Wadi, and oh, he's going to hit her. Oh, to cover the flip jump. Yeah, I like that. Oh, and she missed space that... Wow, barely misfacing or miss not getting the timing to be able to get the up smash for oh a second chance. Man, and Mars Wadi has brought it back from the break. Oh my gosh, that's there. So incredibly smart and definitely what he needed right there to not get hit. Why trying to space in there but doesn't quite get it. And really the first time this set that Mars has been in, been in danger of losing a game. Let's see. Oh, he's got oh. it. What a comeback from Wadi. Yeah, the directional air dodge was so much time on it before you were able to act, so Mars unable to get back to the stage, and Wadi sneaking a win in there after being <laughs> down by so much. Big plays from Wadi. As we said, he just needed a few of them, and, like, you know, on command, his back against the wall. He dug deep and battled his way out and stole the game. And that's what we said. That's where the comeback starts, game, you know, one game at a time. Well, here's another one for you, Wadi. Let's see what you can do with it. Right. And, man, all these top players, not really ones that you see get 3-0'd, right. to be fair. So when they come to that Game 3 situation, they're like, shoot, I haven't won one yet. Then right. they just somehow win that third game. And, you know, as far as adaptations go, one of the things we saw from Wadi was, you know, as we mentioned, Mars's favorite ledge coverage option is to flip jump. You saw Wadi come out really quick with a rising aerial just to cover it. He was able right. to battle his way back out. And that was the opportunity needed to just kind of open up the game and put himself in a position to win it. Such a scary read to go for, too, because if he didn't do the flip jump, he could have boost kicked out right. the fair or anything and punished him hard for it. Oh, that gyro protected him so well right there. Yeah, good get out of jail option from, uh, right. from Wadi. Set that up. That's like, oh, my God, there's a... <laughs> you, like, try to go off on a tangent about the game, and uh, Mars <laughs> has other ideas with how much pressure he puts on. Right, and wow, Wadi oh my has God. so much... What's going on? <laughs> Y'all need to get on the stage. We got off stage fights. <laughs> I don't know like, what happened. <laughs> I can like almost hear it. it's like very European uh, <laughs> Smash 4. <laughs> get off the stage and edge guard the crap out of people. Just uh, Yeah, you got to play it like that sometimes. And I love these boost kicks coming out from Mars. As soon as you whiff an option in his face like that, he's going to punish you heavy. Even if it doesn't kill, that's a lot of percent you're taking. it. I believe it's about 18 to 20. And here we go. Mars has Wadi in a little bit of trouble. Let's see if Wadi's able to battle back. Got that roll read. Boost kick, kill. not the former glory that we used to love. Oh my god, he went after it. And I love the side B too. It's like such a range on that move, knowing that he had the stun. Yeah. Definitely go for it. But fortunately that Wadi wasn't able to, you know, stuff the flip jump recovery coming back. He was pretty close. Right. <laughs> and Mars just waiting, scouting out that back air, <laughs> able to take the stock from Wadi. Level one Yomi back air to see if it hits and uh, lo and behold there's that option. Right. <laughs> Alright, gonna do all three jabs, so you'll take a small punish for that. There to forward air, not going to connect, but he got that up air. And we're seeing a couple, you know, just forward smashes and situations. I think he's just going for miss inputs and he gets, you know, he's trying to go for a short hop forward Yeah, air. or a tilt even. Yeah. All right. We keep seeing the, oh my goodness, Wadi once again trying to get that punish. Oh, Ooh. wow. Drops on forward air, hits him off the stage. 
Yeah, the tech, or the no tech from Wadi gonna cost him heavily. And I wonder if that one he was trying to tech an up, uh, a falling up air instead and may maybe tech too early. Yeah, could have been. Look at all this damage right now. Mars does not allow games to get away from him. Once he starts to be in the deficit, you just see this complete, uh, even more of a turn up from uh, Mars than you do before. But if you're Wadi, the uh, the solace that you have is you've been in this position before against Mars last game, and you're able to battle it back. Yeah. You just got to find some of that magic that he had from game three and try to bring it home. But Very true. Wadi actually does incredibly well when he's behind. All right, he keeps getting these grabs, but just not able to get it before Mars can mash out. Not really sure how uh, Rob's grounding works. The rest of us, we have scaling on our right. groundings, where if you're a higher percent, you should die. Okay, the platform will help him out this time around, though, and he's able to get the up throw. All right, one stock away, or sitting between Mars and a trip to Winner's Finals. Wadi doing everything he can to force a Game 5. Yeah, and we saw him do it before, so maybe he has another chance. But Mars, man, all this aggression, not allowing Wadi any space to breathe or set up his projectiles. This could be a huge problem. Oh, he's got some action happening now. Open him up in the neutral. Wow, that gyro almost catching him on the ledge, too. A great uh, nair there. All right, that's the first hit Wadi's taking on the stock, so not too bad of a position to be in. All right, but already at 100, this could be... This could be terrible if he gets down smashed or grounded. Yeah, it just, it just looks like Mars is not quite able to capitalize on some of the timings from uh, Wadi. You see him trying to parry some of them, but he's just not able to really get the wheels turning. Oh, that might be the opening he needs. Get some off stage. Yeah. Oh, but Wadi going to do a mix up there. Uh, just a side or uh, aerial recovery yeah. right towards the stage. Nice little slippery air dodge. And Mars a little more tentative off stage. Ooh, but he's catching a man. Wadi trying to jump. Mars said, no. What's your next choice? Gonna air dodge again onto the stage and Mars not able to catch it. He cleaned up some of those oh, rolls. No! Oh my god! That's exactly how we went to game five between right. the two at Heart of the Battle. <laughs> he goes for an upbeat and you think that he has it, but it actually just gonna barely whiff it. And they're both laughing, probably thinking the same thing. This is what we just did, man. You know, talking about YOLO options right there. Yeah. It, it, it just appears that there is not a risk that Mars is willing uh, or not willing to take. Yeah, you know? no, they were talking about this. We're all in the same Airbnb, yeah. and they were talking about the game five from before, and it's like, you just know Mars is going to go for that up B. Right. And Mars is like, yeah, it's just a matter of when am I going to go for it. And now if you're Mars, your back's against the wall after having such a comfortable lead. One yeah. of the things that he's going to have to adapt to is, you know, we have been mentioning that Wadi was getting so much punishment off of a, uh, a roll off the ledge habit, but you saw in that last game he had been air dodging, you know, horizontal air dodge to recover. Kind of to the surprise of Mars. Let's see if he's able to adapt and cover and clean up some of that ledge game that right. he was getting so much mileage on. Yeah, and it's like you don't want to get reverse 3 0 You know, right. you're in the position to just take it cleanly, but Wadi somehow sneak, snuck his way back in it. And they're going back and forth, and actually it's Wadi coming out on top early. Yeah. Putting in so much damage in neutral, and it's, you know... That can disappear in the blink of an eye if exactly. Mars gets the wheels turning. Yeah, he had that rare lead last game too, but then uh, got forward air, did tech and died super early off the side, but somehow won that game. We'll see if that can be turned around for Mars this time. Wow. <laughs> They're just juggling each other off stage. Oh my god, Mars with the flip jump. I thought he was coming up for a boost kick off the top. Right. Ooh, and I love the side B again right there. And luckily for him, he didn't have to get put into a position to tech right. off that gyro. Oh Ooh, my god, him. Mars, no fear, drops a double jump forward air, and Wadi holding on for life. He he's got to no watch gas, that fuel. Man. Yeah, he's got to get on right now. Oh, I like the... Oh. Oh, he shouldn't have went for two. I don't think he meant to. I think he was trying to grab ledge and then roll, but yeah, uh, yeah the, he didn't get it. He got the weak hit of the boost kick, unfortunately, and that caused him to air dodge again. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and going for that down smash, just let it go a second too late, so it caused him to take all that damage for it. The music's so intense right now. <laughs> How can he take the stock, man? 133 to 35. Make that 50. I'm having like flashbacks to Pokemon Stadium on the N64. Our combatants are locked in the heat of battle, <laughs> kind of. <laughs> and, you know, just the, the tone and the music oh, got yeah. us to BS2. Oh, and you saw Mars about to set up for a boost kick or something crazy right there. And there it is. But you don't need something crazy if you just spot dodge boost kick. That kind of seems to be his go to boost kick, uh, you know, timing. Right. Oh, and try to catch him off, the, off guard with that down air, but instead the Nair going to take the stock. Wadi at wow. 113, but he's made this comeback before. That was good spacing on Wadi's part because that back air would have killed him. Just barely out of the range of the back air, but enough range for, four, or for the neutral air to hit. Right. Oh, and that stun going to connect right there, and he waits it out for the knockback of the stun, and then gets the forward air. Great stuff, and now you're up an entire stock. No damage even on you. And, of course, if you're Wadi, you know, the... 
the the red alert is going on right now. You got to figure something out. But again, just like we said last game, he's been here before and able to come back. Oh no! <laughs> you can't come back from that. I swear that's how he lost game five. <laughs>